running after work. Feels like it's been ages. Been sticking to the math uh, training. Anybody who follows me on Strava, you would have seen that. And uh, yeah, it's going really well. Over the last six weeks of being back into running, I started off obviously walking the majority of the time to uh, running the majority of the time and taking off about two minutes on the average mile, uh, time off my average mile pace, which is great. And this sounds like an excuse, maybe it is. Because I'm nearly 50, my heart rate target is quite low, 136. But what I'm doing is I'm averaging out my heart rate. So uh, I'm looking at my average heart rate over the whole of the run. And if I go slightly over it on my run, I'm not that bothered. I don't stop straight away. I've got like a target heart rate uh, workable zone from about 120 to, at the moment, 140. And uh, if I go over the 140, then yeah, I'll, uh, I'll stop to a walk. But I found the more I've been doing it, the less walking I've had to do. So I'm running along the section where I did my first ever barefoot shoe run. I got the uh, Vivos on right now. What I found is, I was struggling to run on concrete easily on my uh, barefoot shoes, causing me some uh, pain through the ankles. So instead of giving up on it, which believe me, I did think about it, I switched over to um, Ultra Escalantes to run on the roads. Oh man, it's been amazing, it's been great. Just to get a tiny bit of cushioning under my feet. Oh, it's quite, it's quite muddy around here. Lovely sunset there. Because I love trail running so much, I had to get back on the trails. I couldn't stop myself and uh, I've given myself a bit of a compromise. What I've decided to do is run to heart rate two and not go over that. So I can't really stick to my math heart rate running across cross country as easy as I can on the, the roads there. So what I do is I stick it, keep it under 153 heart rate and that allows me to run in places like this as opposed to dealing with pavements, cars, people. Instead, I can get myself back up to bonus woods, which as you can see, although flat, is pretty awesome. So I can understand why a lot of people don't stick to the math training. That's basically, because it's quite boring. <laughs> Not because it doesn't work. I think it's safe to say that it does work. If you want to increase your aerobic fitness, your aerobic capacity, and you want to get faster, a slower heart rate, give it a go, try it out. Whether or not you'd like to stick to it is another thing. And even I'm not sticking to it. Here I am, running on the trails, 
I'm currently at 140. My map heart rate should be 136. So I've compromised and I'm doing heart rate too on the trails and math training on the roads. And I'll stick to that for the foreseeable future. Taking it slow and easy has definitely helped me not to get injured. So I appreciate you uh, taking your time. If you got this far, stick it with me. Many thanks for watching and I'll see you again. Take care.